Yeah, new shirts finally drop. Go check the link in the description, just byronshop.com. Cop yourself a shirt. There's two types. Go cop yourself whichever one you like. There's some descriptions to help you find your selection. Go check it out. Let's go. Done. Oh shit, I did not taste it. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are good today. We got some more, even more secret number to check out. Like I said in yesterday's video, it seems like every other day something else from secret number comes out that I kind of really want to react to. So today, if you guys didn't know, uh, it finally dropped in where I am, like the Japan album, and there's uh, a lot of songs. But uh, a lot of the songs, only one song was a new song, which is Odyssey, which I already reacted to. If you haven't seen that reaction, go check out yesterday's video. But along with that video or that album, there was this song that we're checking out today, Love Maybe, which is Secret Numbers first OST with the original, only has three members, Dita, Suda, and Zoo. But this one, it seems like all the members are in it, so that's why I really wanted to check out this, because uh, I'm curious what it sounds like with everyone in the song, because in the original, we remember we only had three members in the song. So I'm very curious how the parts will be distributed and uh, what it sounds like. Um, and in the album, there's also a lot of other songs too, like three more songs, but they're all songs that have already been out but it's just a japanese version so if there is a certain one that i should check out that you want me to check out let me know in the comments but uh this was the one that i really wanted to check out just because i wanted to hear how it would sound with all of them in the track um so yeah and um like i said in yesterday's video um i don't really know how the like um releases sort of work because I swear, like with the MV and the comebacks, music video comebacks, I feel like when they release, it release, uh, it releases at the same time for everybody, like in every country and whatever. But it seems like with this album or maybe Japanese songs or whatever, but I swear to when, um, Secret Number debuted with their Japanese song, Like It, Like It, it came out and everyone could listen to it at the same time. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know, with this, I had struggles kind of reacting to it because I wanted to react to it right away when it first came out, but um, the Odyssey song and this album didn't come out to today for me, like the full thing. It actually came out yesterday a little bit um, later, like later in the day at night, at nighttime where I am. And um, for other people, it came out very early for them, like around 12 in the morning for for them. So I don't really know how that works. Um, but uh, I kind of talked more about it in yesterday's video. But some of you guys have already told me about what's going on. So, but I'm just still kind of confused. Just me, just me talking here, just confused. Because I feel like with music videos and like song releases, like music videos, um, the song... It will come out at the same time for everyone, like in every country, every t everything. Like even like like I said, the like a like it song. It came out at the same time, and everyone could listen to it at the same time. I think, um, but if it was different, then you guys let me know. But I feel like when the song came out, everyone was ready for it. Everyone could listen to it at this exact same time. But I feel like with this album, we had like other people had to wait to listen to it, where other people from other countries could react, could listen to the song right away. When other people like me, I had to wait kind of uh, later for me to actually be able to hear the song. Um, but I don't know, that's just me talking. But anyways, let's jump into this, the Love Maybe Japanese version. And it's also 
by everyone in secret number. So if you guys enjoy my videos, if you have not subscribed yet, press subscribe and press that bell notification so you don't miss when I post a new video. You can also follow me on the screen right here. Yeah. And right here, no, this is not, I always, this is how I am. I have my outros, but if you haven't seen my outro, go check it out. It's, there's an outro in this video. So if you haven't seen that, because usually I will tell you about my store. I have a new store, um, justbuyershop.com. You can grab one of my first shirts, home design everything and get that. Usually that's what I say at the end for the outro, but this isn't the outro. This is only the beginning. So that's why I always like point here sometimes. But anyways, let's check out this song, man. You know, chorus line from Leia because we usually don't get that with secret number songs. But this is the first time I'm really hearing Leia get like a full chorus line, you know what I'm saying? Or hook line. And then Ginny had her own chorus line too. And it's the first time really I'm hearing Ginny sing on a secret number track. Another Ginny singing part? Okay. Now, Dita. Oh, not yet? Okay. Hey. Yeah, Leia and Jenny have had a lot of parts in this song so far. No detail yet, though. Hey, yeah. There you are. Okay. I haven't heard any Sudam yet. Oh, there she is. I need to. Yeah! New shirts finally drop. Go check the link in the description, just byronshop.com. Cop yourself a shirt. There's two types. Go cop yourself whichever one you like. There's some descriptions to help you find your selection. Go check it out. Let's go. Done. Oh shit, I did not taste good. <laughs> I feel like we only got like one Sudam line in this song, or in this version. Okay, so if you haven't seen my reaction to the official song with more Sudam in it, because I feel, and Dita as well, I feel like this version didn't really have much Dita or Sudam in which I don't really know, but it did have a lot of Leia and Ginny in it, um, which I actually kind of like because Leia usually doesn't get that many parts in Secret Number songs, but in this song in particular, Leia had a lot of parts, like a lot of the 
first chorus bit, she sang the whole first chorus, and then there's another part in the chorus that Ginny sang. But then, you know, and then Ginny kind of started off the second verse, I think, too, right? Um, but um, this is why I wanted to check out the song, because I was curious how the parts was going to be distributed in this full version. And I didn't expect, though, Dita and Sudam not to get that, like, as much as, because they're the original singers of the song, like, with Zoo as well. But Zoo had, like, like, she started the song, so I think she also started the song in the beginning, in, like, the original song, too. So, uh, I don't know, I thought, like, you know, uh, the three main singers would, like, have the similar amount of parts, but then they just add a couple of lines for the other members as well, but it kind of was different than I was expecting. Um, but it was a pretty good song as well. And my very, not very first, but it's like my first time really hearing Ginny not rap for once and seeing most, I mean, the song doesn't have a rap part, but, uh, my first time really hearing Ginny sing, uh, fully, you know what I'm saying? Cause usually, like I said, she's usually the, the rapper and, um, yeah, so there wasn't much rapping, but she did have a lot of parts, like a lot of singing parts as well on this part. Jenny did. And, uh, again, also Leia had a lot of parts too, which I've been waiting for Leia to have a lot more parts in terms of vocals. And she had a lot of parts in the song as well. So, uh, that's like some cool things and some new things, some things I've been waiting to hear. Um, Jenny's singing voice and just Leia getting more parts. And I don't know if this is going to translate to the Korean songs like they are getting more parts there but uh because i guess this is because this is a japanese song japanese version leia is getting more parts because you know she's japanese she knows uh japanese so it'd be easier for her to sing this but i feel like she also knows uh korean very well she's been in korea i feel like not lo- like besides sudan minji and zoo but she's been like a uh, trainee and like, I think she's been in a group before, like before Secret Number. I don't remember the name of the group, but she's been in like the industry for a while, you know, like training and then being a Secret Number, you know what I'm saying? So Leia's Korean is very, very good. So that's why I'm curious if this, like much of parts from these couple songs and the Japanese debut, if it's going to translate to the Korean side, you know what I'm saying? Because if it does, then that would be great. That's what I've been waiting for. And, um, yeah, let me know in the comments if you feel the same way or not. Uh, and also in the comments, let me know what your thoughts are about, like, the parts that were given in the song. Because, uh, I really feel like Sudam in particular, like, only got, like, one line. And, uh, I think Detail only got, like, two lines, too. So, I don't know. I'm just kind of curious, like, how they kind of distribute these parts. I feel like I always ask this, but, um... I'm pretty sure the way they distribute this, the lines is like each person sings the parts and then whoever sounds the best, they give the lines too. You know what I'm saying? They give that line too. But, uh, I don't know, but I feel like Sudam and Dita already sang the song, but in the Korean version. So I felt like they would have gotten the same amount of parts as they did in the original song, but it wasn't the case. So that was just my thoughts. You know what I'm saying? So. Hopefully you guys, you guys enjoyed this video. If you want me to check out any more of these Japanese versions of songs, cause that's all that's kind of left in the album. I don't remember what songs they have, but I'm pretty sure it's, uh, got that boom, who dis, and I think one more song, Doom Chita maybe. I don't actually know, but, uh, those ones are all songs and they're just a Japanese version. So there's a certain one you want me to check out. Let me know in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Hey, that's the outro. If you want to check out more videos, click on the screen right now. If you want to check out even more videos, go to my channel, check them out. Why you want to subscribe right here as well. And then now you can go right here, go to my shop, justbyronshop.com. Get yourself one of my own shirts, own designs, justbyronshop.com. Get yourself one of my shirts. Click this link right here. You can click this. It'll take you straight to the site, straight to where you can buy one of my own shirts, own designs. And if you want one, man, you gotta get it. You better get it while you still can. Not many sizes left. So once you get, once the sizes shirts sell out, there's not gonna be any more that look like this one right here. So get it while you still can.